Hey, welcome to this channel. My name is Oliver and today we're going to have another session trading with binary options on Quadex. The link is going to be in the description to this video. If you're unfamiliar with the channel, check it out. It's uh, basically I share my experience trading with binary options and trading in general. So right now I'm, I'm having a, a series of sessions of binary options on Quadex. So yeah, that could be useful if you want to learn about that. So check out the description to this video to get the link to the platform, Quadex, and also a Telegram group there where you can learn about trading in general and specifically with binary options, what I do here. And right now we're going to start a session um, of my own so you can learn from that, from my experience. So let's start uh, without further ado. Don't forget to subscribe, like and comment. So guys, today we're going to start with $339 is what I have on my balance there. So we can get some, that's a specific balance, so we can get some uh, numbers there later. But let's start with a the first option and I'm going to go with a 300 option and it's a... Uh, it's going to be the, the the put option um so basically there is a there is a an upper trend was was going on but right now because we have a 1 minute only time um with with that time um i i think that it will uh it will still go go down before going up basically if that makes sense so if we had I mean, if we had few hour, like few hour, not few hours, but an hour or thirty minutes, definitely it would be a call option because um, thirty minutes. Yeah, about thirty minutes. So that would be a call option. But right now, because we have only one minute, we have time. So the market, not we, the market has time to to correct itself, go down a little bit to test this. And here we have the profit to test this, um, this, um, the support level, yeah, and uh, before going up. But later, I'm pretty sure it's going to go up because, in general, in in the bigger picture, there is an upper trend, uptrend, which usually, I mean, let's go with the next one. So here, here we see a clear downtrend, right? And even though. Um, it's trying to it's trying to test this support line there, but I'm gonna go for a call option here actually, because again the say this is the same thing like um, this is a, a downtrend, but we have a situation there where it's trying to it's trying to test this um, the 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 support line, and then we have you know at the bottom also. If you look at MACD um, indicator here, the the, the oscillator, um, we basically we what we see is that it's going close to crossing up the slower line. So the green line is going to cross up cross up the the slower the the red line, and this is a clear indication of the stochastic. Uh, and not stochastic of the oscillator that a, I mean it, it's pretty similar also that a in stochastic as well when when one line crosses the other line for example like the situation now it's about to cross that line that would be indication to go for um, uh, into a uh, long so that was that was that we had a profit and it's already because we started with pretty high numbers Right now, you see this um, this support line there. I'm gonna go for um, long, so I'm gonna go for 30 seconds there. And you see the support line. I'm gonna go for a call option. You see, um, I think that's where it will. Ooh, actually. Oh, that was lucky. That was lucky, I must say. So right now, this this brought us profit. It's almost two thousand already. So we have one one thousand nine hundred ninety two on our balance here. But basically, uh, that was risky, though. That was really risky. 
and if I would go for a longer time I would definitely go for a put option but since excuse since it was um, okay there's another situation we have um, a very similar situation there is a support line that I'm where we're trying to we're trying to break here or, or bounce off hopefully and this this call option is only 30 seconds so it should as you can see it's bouncing off right now but on the like in the bigger picture there is a downtrend that is gonna also is gonna test this like we already had our profit but what it's gonna do is gonna is gonna test this resistance line now and probably go down in, in a bigger picture but because we have really really fast option there that's that's what I do so okay let's let's go with the next option is gonna be one thousand dollars again okay so here we are gonna go for like again this this is a I'm gonna go for a put option here two of them for two thousand actually since we we have um, on our balance more than one thousand now and more than two thousand actually so basically this um, here we can see a downtrend clearly a downtrend um, obviously it didn't get to this uh, support line yet so it, it, it had it had broken the the one support line and then and then it um, it went to test the other one you see it almost broke it anyway so the, the total now on our balance is already 4600 this is a difference like when you start with something like 300 bucks or when you start with something like 30 so it's obviously it's 10 times more and and obviously the it's a lot quicker for our uh, balance to grow okay so this this situation here again we're testing let's make a 4000 put option we're testing this um, this um, resistance line there yeah so last time uh, there it resisted and went down then it started going up basically if it breaks it we can talk about uh, an up uptrend there was an uptrend up until this moment because there is a there is a resistance there but it might as well um, break that line break that level so we'll see we'll see but for now for now for us for one minute it was it was a, a good point to make to make this put option because it might might uh, correct itself here and then go up again like if, if you had a few minutes or more maybe it was um, it would be nice to make a, a call option but here as you can see we've already made the profit from this one and a pretty good one actually in total like we, we just almost not multiplied but it's 87 percent payout but we just made a serious amount and the total actually is eight thousand and eighty two dollars which is already awesome like uh, the time that we spent and it's pretty good so as you can see actually it started going up again you see so but it's trying again it's trying to test this uh, it's trying to break through this uh, resistance line will it we'll see in a second we'll come back to this but for now oh I see a nice uptrend here so actually I'm not sure if it's right let's let's make a a put option here for let's see seven thousand um uh, one minute maybe we have enough time so maybe it's gonna correct itself here so again if I had if I had a few minutes I would go for a call option because there is a clear uptrend here but right now see it's trying to break through this um, resistance line and usually when it goes up when it tries to break through when it goes up like that and 
um, without actually spending some time in the in the zone in the area of the of the resistance level then usually it's it, it will break it through quickly like it did now and then and then go down so this is one of the scenarios Ooh, we we are lucky here and it worked because in a bigger picture it's definitely gonna I mean not definitely but it it's a it's a good so it, it, it might go down now correct it correct a bit um, and then again if it spends a bit more time there and then it would go up so for example okay so we have again an awesome profit from this option because uh, it was seven thousand dollars option and oh wow look at that this is just crazy we don't want that oh that's uh, some nice um, nice downtrend here um, okay let's make a six thousand dollar option put option I mean obviously we see a downtrend here but also we're on the verge of the of the support line so it it depends it might break through that support line if it does we're we're good but if it bounces off if, if that's just the correction in it like this so it, it might as well bounce off it we'll see we'll see in a sec well let's wait for the result here not making it this time yes yeah, so there's there's a couple of situation happening there um, I'm gonna let's go for two minutes here and let's go for 8,000 put option this time and let's wait for the result but basically yeah this what happened is there's not enough time it, it's it's trying to trying to break through but not so quick maybe so yeah timing is 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 everything so let's wait for the result this time and this time guys this is a a a profitable one although it's still on the verge see it's it's just got into a flat here because it's not it's not really moving anywhere but we were lucky enough to to be uh, on the correct side of the of the flat you'd say so this was uh, tricky um, see sometimes this is what happens there's no uh, sometimes this the flat happens and you don't you don't really control that so yeah it's not always perfect it's not always only profit um, but luckily we had let's just change the 30 seconds here let's go for a fiver here so 5,000 um, put option it's a quick one again it's uh, I mean we're we're in uh, we're entering here on if you if you look at it it's a downtrend and basically we can we should be okay here okay that's good right um, there we are nice 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 so we have good profit from this again very very risky this one 30 seconds it's something to play with but uh, 19,000 on the other hand we have so we're gonna use that now for our next option and let's see let's do a it's testing the uh, it's testing this um, this support line right now and again if it breaks through then the downtrend continues but again it can spend sometimes it just starts to spend in time there and becomes a flat 
and it's there's not much you can you can do unless um, unless you wait and you wait through that obviously right now it's not we're not likely to sit and wait around and just you know otherwise it would be too boring to watch and that's why sometimes I try to make it a lot more dynamic but in a in a different situation where you would be trading and learning and you know um, okay let's go for another quick one just as I see this downtrend here I think we have uh, we have some time to so a four thousand year oh Although 30 seconds is see it start going up instead of going down. And then 30 seconds may not be always enough. So if you oh no, that's that's bad. See? This this candle like this is not a normal candle either. So we're lost here. Four thousand went. But this is not a normal candle. We're gonna go for um okay, let's go for Ooh, this put option here, 10k. It's a big one, but this long candle is not a normal situation. So that's why that's why I went in and just made my um, made a quick quick put option here for 10k, and we might we might get some nice profit from this. Obviously, 87%, and here we are, here we are. Uh, did we get it all? No, I don't think so. But we had we had pretty good, maybe all. We had a pretty good um, profit here. So twenty four point um, not point twenty four thousand hundred eighty two dollars on here. So we're gonna we're gonna go for the next open. So see, we had a not profitable one, but then we could make. Um, obviously, I had to I had to make a big one so it, it, the one we lost was a four, 4k and I made a 10k next one so that we could get back what went yeah so the, the not not correct one but yeah you see see the situation actually there is a a pattern there that's starts going on starts going up that's that's uh, also it's pretty tricky but you see the MACD is actually showing us a an indication that oscillator MACD is showing us that the price is actually gonna go up because it's the the green line is crossing the red line to go up so that's that's a nice indication to go for a call option maybe but I'm just gonna go for to the next one well, we see actually there is a let's go for a put option so for a seven thousand put option um, there is a, 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 a there is a, a pattern here called called the descending triangle that goes into from one side that goes into a basically into a and narrowing down the price, a so nar narrowed um, triangle. And here we're in profit. That was a 30 second one again. So that's, but yeah, it's it's definitely a, a triangle here. So from here, and also there is a flag pattern. You could uh, also say that. So from here, it could, we, we would need to wait a bit and see where it starts going from up, up from that point because then we can see where the trend is going so for example here we, we see the candle going up but we need to wait a bit more to see the actual direction of the market so if it if it starts that actually shows um, that the uptrend could be on I mean generally you can see that there is an uptrend if you look at the bigger picture, there is an uptrend, but will it continue? That that depends. So that's why we, if we wait a bit more, we'll see the situation. Because right now, looking at MACD, the the um, the faster line, the green line, 
is actually looking like it, it it's probably gonna cross down the, the red line and that means that the price would go down but it can change so we, we need to wait for this we just need to wait for the oh see that started going down so right now it's on the on the support line here so it was on a resistance it so it resisted maybe it's gonna correct itself and go up or it might break through and go down for a bit at least but right now if we made a a put option we would already be in profit if we had like maybe 30 second option see it it's going through to test this support line well, let's just go for a, a huge option here so because I'm um, by the by the look of it it's 30 seconds anyway it's, it's pretty quick so by the look of it it's it's going to go through this um, this support line and it did but will it will it stay there will it go further or is just a correction and it would go up now but who cares we just had a a profit out of it it may be it may be going up but we just had a profit out of it and an amazing amazing session guys started with three hundred dollars we are now at thirty six thousand three hundred sixty two so we made thirty six grand in this option in this in this trading on um, on Quadex. So guys we're gonna stop here definitely it's a good good uh, session of today the result is amazing you can you can trade like that not necessarily this will happen every day but it it can happen if you know technical analysis for that don't don't hesitate to check out this description to this video to get to this group join a group and, and learn about technical analysis watch our video videos if you're not subscribed consider doing so because there's a lot of as you can see a lot of useful information a lot of trading going on so yeah we'll uh, I'll see you all next time. All the best with your trading and let me know if you have any questions, suggestions in a commentary section and see you next time. Bye.